As you can see by the look on her face, she is super hyped to show you today's mystery bundle. Way to go, Chi. Well, hello there, real gamers. RetroRob here, and welcome to RetroRob Plays Everything. Fanatical's got yet another mystery bundle out, so it's time to take a look at it. This time it's a summer mystery bundle, because, you know, it's hot outside. It is really hot outside by me, man. Wisconsin, great weather. You're either freezing to death or melting. <laughs> There's really no in-between. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Uh, as always, what we're going to do is take a look at what games we get. I'm going to comment a little bit about how I feel about them. Uh, then we're going to put it into a spreadsheet, see how much uh, how much the games were worth versus what we paid, which it's almost always a good deal, and uh, see how many of them I already have and pick a favorite. It's going to be a great time. Great. <laughs> A great time, I tell you. A great time will be had by all. Well, that's a some good green screen work. I know I comment about it a lot, and you'd think I'd improve it, but I'm not going to because I'm jammed like in a little tiny cell here, um, in prison. No, no, no. I'm just in a little tiny area, and it's eh, anyway. Maybe I should just talk like this. It'll work out. Let's go take a look at the bundle. And here it is, the summer mystery bundle. As always, we'll be picking ten keys, or as as is normal, we'll be picking 10 keys. Yeah. Anyway, about this bundle, <laughs> I'm wordy today, as I always am. Get ready for an incredible gaming adventure with the Summer Mystery Bundle. This exclusive bundle gives the gamers opportunities to purchase up to 20 games from a variety of genres, all at an unbeatable price. But here's the twist. The specific titles included in this bundle are shrouded in mystery adding an extra layer of excitement to your gaming experience. Dive into the unknown and explore a treasure trove of gaming possibilities. Wow, I gotta tell you, the writers, they got good writers on this. Anyway, the Summer Mystery Bundle is carefully curated to provide a diverse selection of games, ensuring there's something for everyone, from action-packed adventures to mind-bending puzzles, gripping narratives, to immersive simulations. This bundle has it all. As an added bonus, we've included gaming packs within the bundle. These packs are brimming with high quality games, collectively valued at over a thousand dollars each. I think I think the packs are a thousand. I don't think the games are a thousand. That'd be a pretty expensive game. When they're like a thousand dollar app once, does anybody remember the name of it? There's like an app that was like $1,000 on the Apple uh, App Store at one point, which was just kind of a... I, I think it was called like I'm Rich or something stupid like that. Anyway, we got titles like Starfield Premium Edition, Payday 3 Gold Edition, Street Fighter 6, and Aliens Dark Descent, to name just a few. You never know what hidden gems you might discover as you unravel the mystery of the Summer Mystery Bundle. Here we go. Whew. Excitement. Let's take a look. And it's time to reveal the Summer Mystery Bundle. Ready? Game one. Doom, 1993. I've been getting a lot of the Doom. It's Doom. Never heard of this one. <laughs> You're a Marine, one of Earth's best, recently assigned to the Union Aerospace Corporation Research Facility on Mars. When an experiment malfunctions and creates a portal to hell, the base is overrun by bloodthirsty demons. You must shoot your way out to survive. And of course, this is, a, this is an all-time classic game. By the way, this game, more than many, uh, has aged really well. It's still really fun to play. Uh, overwhelmingly positive on 13,000 reviews. Developed and published by id Software. That's not very surprising. Yeah, I thought it was, it said 1995 here, and I thought it was a little bit older, and it is, 1993. Um, anyway, 4.99 is the price, and um, it's a great game. It's just, I, I would imagine most people have it, I would think. Time to reveal game two of the summer mystery bundle. Ex 
<laughs> Wait, exhorter, exhorter, exhorter. I've never heard of this one. All right. Exhorter, a fantasy turn-based strategy game. Fight for Cerulean. Cerulean? I don't know. And claim the crown as her rightful heir. Enjoy hours of our single-player campaign and battle your friends with Klaus. Klaus. <laughs> with Klaus. It's the German. Uh, it's the German uh, platform. Klaus platform. Right? Cross-platform multiplayer. Expand your skills as a commander with a challenge mode. And uh, it's only got 15 reviews to sit on. It looks nice uh, graphically. Kind of reminds me of uh, Warcraft, doesn't it? A little bit. Anyway, Solid Night Studio developed it, published by No Gravity Games. It's yeah, it's term based. It is on sale for 129, uh, down from a regular of 12.99. It does appear to uh, be on. Look at that, we have Windows and the Mac. So. That's that's kind of nice, and of course Steam, but looks interesting. Game three. Oh, Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. You know, I wanted this a long time ago. This is an older game, but uh, I actually did want this, so huh, nice. Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. This is not the game I thought it was. Uh, the one I was thinking of was a shooter. Anyway, in Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, You'll take command of the colonial fleet in defense of the 12 colonies during the first Cylon War. Lead many types of ships in this 3D tactical game. I'm pretty excited about this, by the way. Every decision, I've got, <laughs> I got the blank face, but this looks pretty good. Every decision counts. Your strategy will be vital. Can you ensure mankind's survival? And the reviews are very positive on 2183 reviews. It was developed by Black Lab Games and published by Slytherin. And Slytherin, uh, I've run into years ago. Uh, I was reviewing uh, games for, I think it was a British uh, video game site. Boy, I can't remember the name of it. I am so sorry. I'll have to look that up. But anyway, I was uh, writing reviews for them, and I did a game by Slytherin, and I thought it was pretty darn good. So it was a, uh, it was like a World War II, I think, uh, tactical game. Anyway. Uh, it's usually $39.99. It's $7.99 on sale right now, 80%. Again, yet another bundle getting just murdered by uh, by sales. But still, um, you know, looks pretty darn good. I wish it was more than just Windows only, but uh, I can play it on my, uh, on my gaming laptop. Looking forward to it. Hey there, real gamers. If you're buying the Fanatical Mystery Bundle, anyway, do me a big favor. Click through the link down below gives the channel a little wee, wee bit wee bit of cash which i uh, spend on booze and cigarettes all right here we go caveman world mountains of unga boonga <laughs> let's let's take a look at this one it's caveman world mountains of unga boonga <laughs> <laughs> Why do I like that name so much? Uh, anyway, Caveman World, Mountains of Oonga Boonga, is a retro-inspired platformer adventure game set in fantasy prehistoric time. You play as a caveman exploring various levels and overcoming physical obstacles. Levels become increasingly more difficult as you encounter enemies, obstacles, traps, and... <laughs> and dots. And ellipses. <laughs> All reviews... Mixed on 396, it's developed by Grab the Game Studios, heard of them before, and published by Grab the Games as well. It is 67 cents right now, down from 199. It's available on the big three platforms, so that's kind of nice. Yeah. It it looks interesting, although it looks very dated. Summer mystery game. Here we go. Hero of the Kingdom, which I already have. I know that for a fact. Hero of the Kingdom. You are living a calm life on your farm with your father. Those times are gone. Flames have turned your house into ashes. Your father's missing. A darkness is falling over the whole country and you're setting off on a dangerous journey. This is going to be the greatest adventure of your life. It's actually pretty fun. I've played this a number of times and I do enjoy it. 
It is a fairly old game. It's sitting on 3,200 very positive reviews. It's developed and published by Lonely Troops. It's um, it, it's one. Of, it's really more of a time management type of game. It roughly, you know, with an adventure tone, but it's it's pretty fun. It's uh, $5.99, and it's not on sale right now. Windows and Mac. Uh, this bundle has been pretty Mac heavy, which uh, usually they aren't. There's been a lot of Mac games on it. Number five. Good night, night. Don't have this one. Yes. Yes. This one. Good night, night. A dynamic hack and slash adventure that mixes procedural generation with handmade scenarios and a darkly humorous story. It, it, everything in there is something I like. Featuring heavy hitting, deliberate combat, robust stealth mechanics, threatening enemies with unique movesets, and a vast array of game changing items to discover. It's only sitting on 35 positive reviews. It's been out since 2021, developed by Red Ember and published by No Gravity. And this actually looks really freaking good to me. This is my kind of jam right here. Uh, so I think I'm going to like this one. This one's probably going to be, uh, probably going to end up being my favorite in the group. It's $14.99, currently not on sale, and it's Windows only. Does it have, control Does it have controls? I wonder if I could play it on my Steam Deck. That would make it even cooler. Number six. Way out. That's funny. I think I just got a coupon for that one. I'm almost sure of it. Way out. Relax. Clear your mind and find the way out. Well, that's um, that's about as simple of a description as you can get. It's sitting on 928 very positive reviews. If you like these little types of puzzle games, uh, I'm sure it would appeal. Looks, I mean, graphically it looks very nice. I'm gonna give it a try. Uh, I only very occasionally like this kind of thing. Um, I kind of got back to it on the Pokito because uh, they make a number of those. If you haven't seen my videos on the Pokito handheld, it's, it's a clicky little handheld. It's very enjoyable. Uh, to play about anything on and I was getting into some of these small little puzzles on there just because it's it's got a like feel to it but I don't know how I'd feel about just playing it on my PC or Mac or whatever I feel like playing it on anyway it's at 74 cents right now uh, available on Windows Mac and it says Steam OS so there we go American Fugitive I have this game already, but it is really, really good. I like this game a lot. Did a gameplay on it, in fact. American Fugitive. Free update. State of emergency is out now. Framed for your father's murder, you'll need to do whatever it takes to unveil the real culprit. Tackle thrilling missions for the criminal underworld. Just don't let the cops track you down. Sitting on 1,400 mostly positive reviews. Uh, it was made back in 2019. Developed and developed by Fallen Tree Games and published by Curve. And uh, I'm gonna tell you, uh, I've played this game and I've done a video on it. It is absolutely an excellent game. It is a great game. And I have more than two freaking hours into it. That, what what is up with that? I have games that I played for like four hours and it says I got 20 hours on. I understand that. Okay, I get that when that happens, but. <laughs> Game, I think I'm pretty sure I've live streamed more than two hours of this game. Anyway, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. It is currently $1.99, which is a steal. So if you're watching this video and, uh, you know, old style uh, Grand Theft Auto appeals to you or dual stick shooters, you absolutely want to pick up this game. It is just a great game. Number nine. Hero of the Kingdom, The Lost Tales 1. Pretty sure I have this one too. Pretty sure. Not 100% though. How many Hero of the Kingdom games are there? Uh, anyway, I don't have this one. I'm kind of surprised to say. You come to a city that lives in fear of a terrible dragon. The desire for justice brings you to a dangerous quest with your new friend, Brent. You have to 
<laughs> yeah, why is that so funny? Hey, Brent, let's go hunt dragons. You, you had to find the dragon and fight the greatest struggle of your life. Your heroic courage will save the city from evil. Sitting on 868 very positive reviews. It was released back in 2020. It's developed and published by Lonely Troops. And, ooh, Windows and Mac. And, of course, the Steam OS. And it's for $99 retail. And I'm surprised I don't have that one. Hmm. And the last game is... Stygian, Reign of the Old Ones. And I've not heard of this one either. Looks interesting. Stygian, Reign of the Old Ones this is the last game. Delve into a role-playing game of horror, loss, and madness set in the strange worlds of HP Lovecraft. I used to be a big Lovecraft fan. Had, had all this stuff. I still have a couple, uh, a couple of compilations of his works. Stygian, of his works, it sounds so... Mm, it works. Anyway, Stygian Reign of the Old Ones offers a mix of rich role-playing and turn-based tactical combat. Now, that's interesting. Represented in an illustrative visual style. Can you find salvation in a dead world? Uh, 1,629 mixed reviews uh, made back in 2019. It's by Cultic Games, published by Folk. It's Folk Rum. <laughs> Folkworum Publishing. Interesting. And again, very, very Mac heavy uh, today. We got Windows, we got Mac, and we also have Steam. So that's, that's similar to Darkest Dungeons. Huh. Anyway, you can download a demo of it, it looks like. It's always nice when they do that. But uh, it actually does look interesting to me. Who knows? It might be one of those games where it's not getting great reviews, but I like it. It does happen on a fairly regular basis. All right. That's it. The last game. And here's the tale of the tape for the Summer Mystery Bundle 2023. We've got Doom coming in at $4.99, which I already had. We've got Exhorter. At one twenty nine, it was on sale uh, originally twelve ninety nine. As always, this one gets hurt by uh, sales, but you know, I mean, sales aren't a bad thing. Anyway, just just for the bottom line of this spreadsheet, uh, Battlestar Galactica Deadlock seven ninety nine. Pre sale price was thirty nine ninety nine. So that would have been a huge one. Um, that would have been a full price game, but uh, it was on sale, so that cuts quite a bit out of the total value. Caveman World came in at $0.67. Cents. It also was on sale. Hero of the Kingdom, $5.99. Good Night Night, $14.99. And then we got Way Out, $0.74 cents on a whopping $0.20 cents sale. American Fugitive, huge discount this week, uh, $1.99 down from $19.99. And then we got Hero of the Kingdom, Lost Tales, $1.599. I was kind of surprised I didn't have that one. Uh, Stygian, Reign of the Old Ones, $19.99. Uh, so we got a total running price of $64.63 for my $7. Uh, if it weren't on sale, we would have had $127.90. Again, a couple of those were really heavily discounted right now. Uh, had, what, one, two, I felt like more. Did feel like more. I only had three of the games uh, that were in there, and considering how many games I have on Steam, that's that's pretty good. Uh, comparing it down, I think it did way better than the VIP Mystery Bundle, uh, which I actually paid more for. So that one also got heavily hit by sales, but still, uh, even looking at the bottom line, 127 132 but I paid uh, nearly twice as much for VIP Mystery Bundle too. So Summer Mystery Bundle appears to be a better deal, at least so far as my luck uh, went. Fiesta Mystery Bundle did 86 70 um, that said, I, I kind of liked what I got in this one a little bit better. Mystery on the Move. I'm not going to go too far back. Uh, 101, just, that one nailed it. <laughs> Mystery Mayhem, also another one that totally nailed it. Really did, uh, really had a lot of good games in it. But, uh, anyway, there we go. That's, that's the wrap. Still a pretty good deal. Uh, favorite game in this one. 
Um, I'm going to say that it's going to be good night, night. I'm looking really forward to playing that one. Uh, that said, if I hadn't had it before, uh, American Fugitive is an excellent, excellent game. Well worth playing. Also looking forward to Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. Anyway, let me know what your favorite game in this list is. And if you got something great in your summer mystery bundle, let me know about that as well. Or if it didn't go so well, feel free to say that too, because that's, you know, it's all in the luck, really. Anyway, I want to thank you very much for watching this video. If you found it useful or enjoyed it, please do me a big favor. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in a couple days. Bye.